Learn the truth about the game by joining dating and life coach Mr. Locario and Miles Cunningham live in New York City on Saturday, April 14th at the NYC Seminar and Conference Center for the Truth About the Game Seminar. In this seminar, Mr. Locario will teach you exactly what you need to know to be successful with women. Space is extremely limited, so purchase your tickets today at MrLocario.com. That's M-R-L-O-C-A-R-I-O.com. MrLocario.com. Yo, what's going on? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So you see the title of the video, right? And the reason why I titled it this is because I was on a message board. And, you know, I'll be looking at message boards sometimes. I read a lot of people's emails that people send me. Um, I look at comments on all the videos that I do. And I also look at comments on other people's videos about the game. And, you know, sometimes I say to myself, I'm like, you know, I, like I actually ask myself this question. I'm like, is what I do necessary? Like, is it really necessary? Because, like, I, I seriously, honestly, like, sometimes sit and I say, you know, shouldn't people know this? Like, seriously, when I first started to coach, I was like, is this is this needed? Like, do people need this information? And, you know, every day it, it just keeps, you know, I keep getting an answer to this question when I see dudes out there doing fuck shit. I'm just like, God damn, you know, like cats out here lying to chicks Dudes out here, you know, thinking that approaching is just for average or ugly looking dudes, you know, because like on this forum, I was reading the, you know, some of the comments and stuff. And basically they were talking about approaching women and they were saying like, oh, you know, if you're really good looking, then you don't have to approach women because women are just going to throw their pussy at you. You know, they're just going to be like, here, take it. You understand? Like, and so. A lot of guys don't, they, they just don't understand what's really going on out here, right? So, you know, I wanted to talk about this whole uh, topic of, you know, approaching is for, you know, average or ugly dudes or whatever, right? And so the whole premise of this really came from the people on this message board saying that, you know, if you're good looking, then shit is just going to be easy or whatever. And what you have to understand is, is that women in general, right? Even if a girl thinks you're, you know, a good looking dude or whatever, most of the time they're not going to be aggressive. Most of the time. Now, you know, you always have exceptions to the rule where a chick might, you know, roll up on some dude because she's just really attracted to him and she'll go up and, and say something or try to get with him or whatever. But that's rare. That's like super, super rare. You know, 90 some percent of the time that's not going to happen right so even if a girl thinks you are physically attractive she's like oh my god he's so sexy this and this and that whatever whatever she's looking at this dude like you know on a physical level like she's like oh he's bad he could get it whatever right she's still not going to approach him you understand so the most she might do is you know, just look at him or maybe smile at her or something like that. It's still up to him to go and approach. You see what I'm saying? He still has to go and approach. So the thing is, you're not going to just have chicks, you know, like uh, kicking down your door and, and you know, chasing you. You know what I'm saying? Isn't this not that's not happening. So the thing is, is that it's not about approaching uh Women are, is for like average dudes or ugly dudes because they have to do it because since they're not quote unquote good looking enough, no woman is going to approach them. No, see, it don't matter how you look. It don't matter, uh, you know, if, if this chick thinks you're the sexiest dude alive, most of them aren't going to go and approach you. Because they also have an ego. They also don't want to get rejected. You see what I'm saying? And also just, you know, the way society is, it's not, you know, a social norm for women to generally go and approach a dude. Right? 
Because now some of you will say, oh, well, the guy the guy, the guy, guy who she thinks is good looking has an advantage because she's choosing and she's checking him out and all this other stuff. And, yeah, that's, that's good that that's happening, but he still has to approach. So approaching isn't just designated for, uh, you know, the guys who are average to below average looking. You understand? Because you're still going to have to approach either fucking way. So the thing is, is that, you know, a lot of guys, they sort of have this like good looking guy fantasy where they think that, you know, everything's just going to be easier if you're good looking. I'm actually I'm have to do another video about that, too, where dudes for, you know, for some reason, they think everything is just easier because, you know, a chick would think you're good looking. Now, the stupid part about this whole situation when we talk about this is, again, what is good looking is still subjective anyway. You understand? So, you know, you thinking that, okay, well, just because you're good looking, that everything's going to be easy, you're just fooling yourself. And see, when it comes to this whole approaching thing, right, the approaching of a woman that's the easy part. That's the easy part. Any guy can go and approach a chick. Right? The It gets a little bit more complex when it comes to the actual interaction where you guys are going back and forth and talking. Because you could be that good looking dude. Then you start talking. And if you your game is whack, she ain't going to be wanting to fuck with you. If your game is tight, she'll want to fuck with you. Even if you're not that uh, good-looking dude or the type of dude she thinks is the best-looking guy, you go up to her. If your game is tight, you know how to spit. She'll have a conversation with you. If you know the conversation's tight, she'll be feeling you. If the conversation's not tight, she's not gonna be feeling you. You understand? There's levels to uh, what makes a woman attracted to you. You understand what I'm saying? So, for you guys out there just thinking, oh, you know, um. It's just going to be easy to approach or I don't need to a guy that's good looking doesn't need to approach because he's going to have just girls flocking all over him. It, no. You understand? But you guys, you got to you got to you got to understand what's really going on out here, because when you when you have this type of thought process or you think about the game this way, you're basically you're, you're just off. You're off. You don't understand. You don't understand what the hell's really going on out here. Because you're thinking about the shit too, just on a simplistic level. You're, 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 you're making it too simple. See, the game, you know, technically is not really that complicated, but it's also not that simple. You see what I mean? Because you think, oh, just the guy looks this way. So he don't have to approach women because women are just going to be jumping all over him. But then you, you, when you say that, you fucking ignore the fact that most women don't approach men anyway. Just in general. You understand? Then you're thinking, well, the guy is just so good looking that the women are going to just flock and approach him. You understand? See, the only time you see that type of shit a lot of times is let's say if you are like looking at a dude who's maybe like a celebrity or, you know, like yeah, he's like a famous rapper, musician, whatever it is, and chicks will run up on him and jump all over him and try to talk to him and, and whatever. But that's because he's a, he's a celebrity. And also that, uh, you know, him being a celebrity, right? That lends itself to that type of culture when it comes to a guy being a famous celebrity. So women are already, you know, um, in society doing that anyway. So therefore, to other women, it's okay for them to do that to him. You understand him being that celebrity. Now, when it comes to the every, you know, the everyday average type of dude, it's not looked, uh, you know, is looked sort of down upon sometimes. For a woman to be forward with a guy like that. So even if she wanted to, most times she won't because of the societal standards and the societal norms. So even though, you know, she's looking at this dude and she's like, oh, my God, he's so cute or whatever. And she wants to, uh, you know, 
go up and talk to him, she most likely won't because of those societal norms. You see what I'm saying? So this is the type of shit that you, you know, some guys don't think about when it comes to the game. You got to think about everything. See, when you're just sort of like, uh, you know, looking at shit in on, on one level, you miss out on all this other shit that's important to the actual situation that you're trying to learn about. You see what I'm saying? So you got to understand that, you know, it's it's not this thing where, uh, you know, a guy who's quote unquote this good looking dude has this magical power that, you know, he's going to walk into a room and all the girls is going to jump on him and he doesn't have to do anything. He doesn't, he doesn't have to approach a chick ever. He just doesn't. It's just, you know, chicks are just going to come through, you know, give him the number, suck his dick and, and call it a day. And the rest of you uh, average and ugly guys, you got to approach because that's not going to happen to you because you don't have the magical good looking boy powers. <sighs> man, man, man. Click the link below or go straight to MrLocario.com to get your tickets for the Truth About the Game seminar. Space is limited, so get your tickets today. Hey, what's up? It's dating and life coach Mr. Locario. Go to BadBoyMembership.com and master the dating game by joining my Bad Boy Membership program. In this program, you'll receive 45 through 90 minute, easy to follow, step-by-step -step dating advice tutorials that's guaranteed to help you attract, date, and have sex with beautiful women. Join the Bad Boy membership today by going to badboymembership.com that's badboymembership.com